Hello and welcome, this is Alf again from the Final Community. Today I'm going to show you a little bit our uh, new panel. By the way, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, we only got 7, come on guys. Here we go, this is a new Z panel X. As you can see here, I got two new domains. Today I'm going to show you how to uh, start to uh, create a uh, new reseller package or new clients and FTP accounts. A little bit of everything, alright? Okay, let's start. Um, let's see. We'll go to package manager. And at the moment, there is only one package called administration. I'm going to create a new package called reseller. I'm going to give a PHP, C, CGI, and I'm going to say that the reseller can have as many as he wants, say 900 domains and 999 uh, Sub domains. How many park do we give it the maximum as well? Uh, we're going to give uh, by 500 mailboxes, 900 forwarders, uh, distribution lists, another 900 uh, FTP account, uh, let's say 999 again, database as well. This quarter we're going to give. Oh, Let's see the maximum here. Nine nine nine. Nine nine. I'm going to save it. Also, I'm going to create a couple of uh, users uh, packages. I'm going to call it one gold, and I'm also going to give PHP and CGI. But I'm going to give just five domains. Uh, let's say 5 times 25, say 25, uh, bracket domains 25, mailboxes 100, 100 forwarders, uh, distribution is 100, FTP accounts we're going to give, um, let's say 25, 125, we're going to give 100, and we're going to give again a limited space and a limited bandwidth. That's on the gold one. There we go. After we do that, I'm going to create a new reseller account. Actually, you can create groups if you wanted to. They already are administrators, resellers, and users. So the first one I'm going to call it reseller one. And I'm only going to make it easy. So I don't want to make it difficult. This is just for uh, this workshop purpose. It's not real. So and I'm going to call it reseller, the package reseller. And I'm going to call it reseller, and I'm going to use reseller at mango.it. Any address, any postcode, I'm going to put any numbers there. Make sure you read. All this make sure you change it you know the way you want it and I'm gonna save it in the same way you can actually create users user one I'm going to choose the user one as a password so make it easy users package I'm going to give a gold package User one, user one at mango dot it. Any address? I'm 
Any passcode? Some numbers here. Send a welcome. You don't want to do that. Uh, save it. Right, so let's say user one, two, three, four, five. Let's try it again. And there we go. Now we got the reseller and we got a gold user. For FTP, we do exactly the same thing. I'm going to show it now. I'm going to create two accounts. At the moment, there's only one there. I'm going to create a reseller. Give full access using existing. Um, let's call a new one. Make a for a new seller. Let's, um, one. So I know what I'm doing. Logically, that will be given to the reseller. Although the actual reseller can do it himself. This is again just to show you and user give again a full access and create their own home directory. Press Z now again to go to the main screen or let's remove that. We don't want it. This is the basics of what you do. Um, logically, if you log out and you log in as reseller. Then you can actually control your reselling package and your users. So as you see, I just logged in as a reseller, and from here I can do the rest. I can manage my clients, I can uh, manage my FTP accounts, and all the rest. I'm going to log off again here. What does that mean? So as you can see, this is the actual basics that you need to know to start out. For the domain, again, it's very easy. Just go on domains. I got already two domains here. Uh, if you need to put another one here, I'm going to put uh, cp.pic.co.uk. Uh, create a new one. And waiting for the actual crown to go, and they will be live anyway. Once it's live, uh, it will appear here as well, green, and you will be able to access this one as well. That's not, you know, very simply. Here you will find more and more. Uh, my, my SQL database, very simple to. Uh, to create a new set, uh, database, logically this will be based just for the admin. So every user or uh, reseller need to do their own uh, MySQL database. Otherwise, it will be a little bit confusing. From uh, the next couple of uh, tutorials I'm going to make, I'm going to explain how to install uh, WordPress and Joomla. If you have any other uh, requests, just let me know in the forum. Uh, you can find us at uh, forums.zpanelcp.com. Thank you again for uh, listening to this tutorial, and I'll see you next time. Bye.